What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we've got a pretty cool video of a new light from Streamlight that is not like any other light that we've done. Most of the lights from Streamlight have been uh, WML lights. This one is actually to be able to put, you can put it on your helmet or on a plate carrier. This is the Streamlight Sidewinder Stalk. Now this is the new light very different from any other light that we've done here, especially from Streamlight on the channel. It does put out a white light, red light, blue light, green light, and IR light. Something really cool about this is it does use a CR123A battery, but you are able to use a AA battery as well, which is pretty different and uh, very, very nice as far as uh, batteries that you can get a hold of. Most of the lights usually you use CR123, uh, but it it's odd that you come across one that can use both with that and a AA battery. So that is really, really nice. Uh, it is worth mentioning you can use, like I said, the CR123 uh, battery and a AA, but as far as performance out of this, you are going to get a better performance performance out of it with a CR battery uh, and you can use this like I said for mounting on a helmet or your play carrier. You do have a push button here for uh, on and then you have a selector switch here which has got off, white light, IR or color and when you put it on color you can uh, switch between the uh, blue, green or red light. It does have a waterproof uh, rating of IPX7, which is a submersible one meter down for 30 minutes, which is really, really nice. For runtime settings with the brightness, if you have it on high, you've only got a runtime of 5.6 hours. If you've got it on the low setting, it will run for 96 hours. You've got a beam of 28 meters. Candela is anywhere from 12 to 200. The overall length is 5.51 inches long and weighs in at 2.88 ounces. And something else, you can only get it in this one color, the coyote tan color. You can't get it in black or any other color. This is the only color that you can get this in. And something worth noting, you do when you order this, you get a bunch of different mounts for a wide variety of mounting this on just about anything, which is very, very nice. If you're wanting to switch between the different colors, you'll put it over to the color setting and you'll turn it on. Right now it is red, and I didn't mention this earlier, but this is uh, bendable. You can move this all sorts of different ways. Now, once you put it to the color setting, you should be able to tap this five times and it will circulate between the red, blue, and green color. And then when you get to the color that you want, you let off and it's circulating. And then if I want the green light, I'll wait until it gets to the green light and I'll let off and that's the color it goes to. And then if you've got this on, you can press this button down, hold it down and it will circulate through the different brightness settings as you can see here. And then when you just let off, it will stay at that brightness setting. This guy does come in at about $130 depending on where you're looking for, for it. Uh, I don't actually have a helmet to mount this on, so I'm going to mount this on one of my plate carriers. This is my main go-to. This particular plate carrier is from uh, HRT. If you're interested in anything going on here, I did do a video on that, so you can check that out. And it does have a clip back here just to mount it on uh, a Molly setting. And then it just clips on any molly setting and then you can bend this any type of way and then you've got a selector switch here to move it to anywhere you want and then the quick button to turn it on as well Ooh. 
So that is the new stream light light. So that is all I have for you guys today. Be sure to check out all my other videos up here on the channel. I have done a bunch of other videos with Streamlight. They did sponsor this video. They've sponsored all the other Streamlight videos just by sending the light out to me to show to you guys. I really appreciate them. Be sure to check them out on their website. If you haven't yet, be sure to give me a thumbs up if you like this video and uh, let me know all of your thoughts down in the comment section below if you've tried any of Streamlight's lights or if you like any lights other than stream lights, let me know all of your thoughts down in the comment section below. And if you haven't yet, be sure to consider getting subscribed to the channel. Be sure to check me out on Instagram at the Josh Wiley channel. I post a bunch of pictures on there. Some stuff doesn't quite make it out here to a actual video here on YouTube. So be sure to check out everything going on over there and be sure to ring the bell so you don't miss anything here on the channel. That is all I have for you guys, and I will see you in the next video. See ya.